Hey Dance, how's it going? I uh, hope the week started well. Uh, so just going through those reviews, obviously a lot of really good looking stuff. So yeah, you know, the knee's not there, okay, but it's also not here. It is much better and it's definitely leading to what we really first worked on, which is that lateral move. Okay, that was sort of 85% eradicated. Okay, so yes, keep working on it, all right, um, but it is looking so, so good. And remember, I said a few weeks ago, sort of planting the seed, we don't actually ever want it, not really, ever to be there. Okay, because we love that release of the heel, okay, and then the timing of the heel point. I mentioned in that one video how you created so much lag. That's energy. It's stored energy. All right, so really, really good. So we actually want it over the long term just to have a little bit of release so we can learn to plant it nice and early. Okay, that's going to be where we're leading towards after 89. Okay, this, this short game, pitching wedge out of the waste areas, get back in play, um, and some putting. All right, and we keep doing that same stuff, keep reviewing the management of the round, and yes, the putting, I'm mentioning that again. Okay, keep reviewing all of that. Okay, and we're going to get to that 89. From there, if we want to push forward, then we might, you know, make things a little more complicated as to the dynamic moves and how those moves we've learned work together. We wouldn't necessarily have to learn much sort of anything new, let's say, um, but we would maybe work, learn how they sort of work more dynamically together. Okay, anyway, getting off topic, getting off topic, sorry. Right, so I'm very, very happy with where these things are at, okay? Um, if you get a chance, do a little warm-up drill again, do a little sort of seven to five, but remember just to have a little bit of angle. Okay, seven to five, eight to um, four, nine to three. Okay, remember we're using the left arm as the guide, right? So there's your seven o'clock, a little bit of wrist work. There's your eight o'clock, nine o'clock, and so you kind of go. Just do a little bit of warm up if you get a chance. Okay, don't have to send videos, but just, well, you can if you want. Um, but good sort of um, for our short game. All right, but just good to synchronize all the moves we're actually trying to make. Yeah? Um, but otherwise, we're going to keep focusing on the same stuff, right? So making sure that we load the backswing beautifully, no collapsing, no lateral. Okay, change of direction is looking great. We're right on top of the ball. Okay, keep turning, release later. So that's we're going to add on again this week. Okay, we left it for a couple weeks. We're going to add it on. Okay, we see the release is still a little bit early, a little bit narrow. Okay, so we're going to do a little bit of release point draw and then keep our focus on that left knee on loading the backswing. That's where our focus is going to be. Okay, right. So I started with release point draw. If you've done a little short game warm up, fine. If not, doesn't matter. Okay, so release point draw about three foot in front of the golf ball. All right, swinging back above the golf ball, coming back with a lot of lag handle in front. I'm exaggerating slightly, but and then trying to. Snap it straight just after the golf ball. Okay. If you hit a few thin and a few tops, then probably on the right track, but obviously send me a video. Okay, as we go. Right? So release point draw starting out there. Okay, within the hit. Yeah, we're not stopping like this within the hit. Okay. Starting out there. Back. Okay, and even that follow you saw there. Oh, I've swing, but Really nice extension and nice sound. Yeah? Okay, so a few of those, and then we've got our ball. Okay, so ball between the legs. Focus on staying very lateral. Don't allow yourself to go lateral. Okay, on uh, once you got the ball there because the knee's stuck. Okay, right on the spot. If it means shorter swings, whatever, it's fine. Slower swings, absolutely fine. Okay, so ball between the legs. Really still. Focus on loading straight over the golf ball, no lateral movement. Okay. All right. And then you go into your normal ones. Look, you kind of the theory is putting them both together, but our huge focus is no and no. Okay, so keep that solid load over the golf ball. Okay, and then slowly start releasing it a little bit later if you can feel it. Okay. So draw one release point for the later release. Drill two, stability of the knees and the backswing. Okay, and then three, just hit balls. Try to see if you can put the two together. 
Okay, but obviously backswing is number one most important. Okay, we're going to track your putting for the next couple of weeks. All right, and just see if obviously we'll take a, a, another look. Actually, you know what, send me some putting videos when you get a chance. I'll take a look if the setup and stroke, strike and release are what we spoke about. And then we'll start looking at, okay, maybe is it a, a read thing? Are you reading the greens correctly? Okay, um, or is it a distance control thing? Okay. That's what we're going to try and isolate. Okay. We'll only isolate that in a couple of weeks' time, so don't worry about that. Um, but if you want to or you've got putting videos, just send them in the meantime just so I can start planning and have a little look. Okay. But those are your drills. Warm up if you want to with your little clock system, short game. Otherwise, it's release point drill. Okay, ball between the legs drill. And then third one, swings, trying to put the two together if you can. All right. Thank you. Have a lovely day, lovely rest of the week. And obviously let me know if you need anything.